What is up guys? Welcome to another video brought to you by Statistically Challenged. Today we are going to be looking at secret slash uncommon money making methods in old school RuneScape that can make over 500k an hour. So let's get right to it. For our first method we are going to be baking potatoes. So what you're going to want to do is get your ass to the Grand Exchange and buy some potatoes. After you've bought the desired amount of potatoes, what you're going to want to do is get yourself to a cooking range. Now there are a lot of cooking ranges in the game, but the one I'm going to be using for this video is going to be the one in Edgeville. Now you're just going to take out your potatoes from your bank, take them to the cooking range. You will cook these without failure every single time on a range. It will not work on a fire, so make sure you are cooking them at a cooking range. Each time you cook a potato, you will receive a baked potato and 15 cooking experience. After you're done cooking a full inventory, return to the bank and repeat the same process. If I sold 28 baked potatoes on the Grand Exchange, I would get around 8.4k. We're making around 7.5k profit every single inventory. So this method should bring in 400 to 500 k per hour depending on how AFK or active you are, although this is a very AFK method, so it's pretty nice. On to method 2. For method 2, get yourself to the gnome stronghold. We are going to be making blurberry specials. Once you're here, climb up the ladder and run directly east. Here you are going to see an NPC called Heckle Funch. Once you are at Heckle Funch, you're going to want to right click him and trade him. And you're going to want to buy one brandy, one gin, one vodka, equal leaves, two oranges, three lemons, one lime along with a cocktail glass, a cocktail shaker, and a knife. Now that you have all these items in your inventory, you're just going to want to right click your cocktail shaker and select the mixed cocktail, and then select the blurberry special. Now you're going to use your knife on the lemon to dice the lemon to get lemon chunks. Use your knife on the orange to dice the orange to get orange chunks. And then use your knife on the lime to get sliced lime. And then all you're going to do is left click pour mix special. You will get 150 cooking experience, and you will get a Blurberry Special. If you can do this fast, you can make a Blurberry Special in roughly 10 seconds, and every Blurberry Special you make is worth 5.7k, so this can make you over 1 mil an hour if you are active enough and do it properly. I'm just going to show you that this can be done quite fast, uh, it doesn't take too long, you can actually make one in, you know, like under 20 seconds if you know exactly what to buy. Um, and you will after you do this a couple times. And every time you're making one of these, you are actually profiting around 5.6k, I believe. They're worth 5.7k in the GE. And we're going to go sell them right now. As you can see, we successfully sold the five three ray specials for around 5.65k each, which is insane profit because we are barely spending 100 GP for the supplies. So, get good at this, and you can make over 1 mil an hour. On to method 3. So for method 3, all you're going to need again is some starting cash. You're going to go to the Grand Exchange and buy some blue d hat. Buy as many as you can. I'm going to buy a hundred for the sake of this video. Once you have your d hat, you're going to want to go to Al Karid. The best way to get there is grab a Ring of Dueling and teleport to the Alcarid Duel Arena. Then once you're in Alcarid, you're going to want to head to the bank. Once you're at the bank, just take out your blue dragon hides. And with some cash in your inventory, run to the Tanner, which is located by the t-shirt icon. Then what you're going to want to do is just right click the blue dehyde and select all. Now you will have all your blue dehydes tanned into blue dragon leather. You're going to want to bank them and repeat this process. I'm now done tanning my leather and I'm back at the Grand Exchange. As you can see from the history, we spent 225.4k buying all the leathers. And we just turned 100 of those into tanned leathers and we're going to sell them now. After selling them, as you can see, we made around 20k just selling back the 100 leathers that we tanned. The great thing about this is that only took me about 4 minutes to tan 100 leathers, which is just around 4 trips from the bank to the tanner. 
So for tanning blue dehyde, you're looking at around 600k per hour, assuming that every 5 minutes you can do um, 100 leathers and make around 20k profit. So that about wraps it up guys, I hope you enjoyed these 3 secret slash unknown money makers and I hope you can use them to make some bank yourself. If you guys want more, and if you guys enjoyed this vid and want more please leave a like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you in the next vid. Thank you all for watching and have a great day.